it, good girl. And you'd like. You'd like to. Because you've been a very good girl. And today, we had some people over. And um, Jake came over yesterday. And um, we watched some TV. And um, we, went, we went for a walk today, didn't we? Walk. And, um, and um, we had some stuff. We had some, we had some smackos. And uh, we also had some dental sticks. Oh, we did, we did. That was good, wasn't it? And we're a targeted individual of the Australian government and we have no home. We're not welcome anywhere. That's pretty bad, isn't it? And we've asked everyone for help and no one can help us. So what are we going to do? We're just going to hang in there, don't we? We're going to try and advocate for justice and human rights and dignity. And we're just going to say... We never wished any harm on anyone, did we? You and me? Did we? No. We can... What about if we... What about... We could get some... Um, some milk. That would be nice. And tomorrow, we'll go to bed and we'll have a big sleep. Go to bed and we'll go down to bed. And then tomorrow, we're going to get up and we're gonna um, we're gonna um we're gonna go for wheeze and we'll go for a walk at the back and then we might go for a walk around the block and then um guess who's coming jake's coming i know i know that'll be good and then um we're gonna fight the law fight the law and fight for justice because um we can't live with no human rights and no dignity and no money, can we? And no home. We need a home, don't we? You and me? We do. We deserve a home because we're, I'm a human being and you're the creator of the universe, the God, <laughs> the, the feminine God. Is that right? What, what are you waiting for? Some... What about. <laughs> oh, all right. I, I just got to ask you something. Can you. Wait, 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 wait. Not yet, not yet, not yet. Can, oh, can you... I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. I, I love you. I do. And... It'd be good if we could ask a politician for help. And it'd be good if we could ask the mayor. It would be good if people who were paid to care of us, care for us, actually cared for us. Like the NDIS, who were proven to be abusing me. And you know what, Crystal? If we had $73,000 three months ago, we'd be able to look after ourselves, wouldn't we? But instead, the NDIS has shoveled it all to other people. They have. And they've paid them and not paid us. And that's pretty shit, isn't it? It is. You know what? It's pretty shit being a rejected whistleblower because you can't report a crime to police and you can't get a lawyer and you can't call that corruption. Oh, and everything's corrupt. Except for us, darling. You and me. That's right. And um, what are we going to do tomorrow when we get up? I think we'll um, go for a walk. I love you. <laughs> and, and we'll, um, what can we do? What, why don't we um, talk to Mitch? He might be able to help us. Our friend Mitch. He's, he's, he's going to be our power of attorney and take control of our life because we, we can't say anything anymore. We can't say anything because um, no one will listen. Mum won't listen. Susie won't listen. Trav won't listen, the, the government won't listen, and um, a politician won't listen, the lawyer won't listen, the public interest disclosure scheme won't listen, and um, no, can you do Paul? Oh, what a good girl. What a good girl. You're a beautiful girl, aren't you? And we, we do deserve a house. So if anyone's in Sydney, my name's Baron Dodger, and you can go to barondodger.com.au, that's B. A double R A N D O D 
gercomau because um I just wish to say my glasses are broken. I've got no barely food and um, no money and me and Crystal are deserving of a home and we're in Sydney and um we're owed a lot of money, probably millions of dollars. If you could put us up in a home, like just a safe a safe place because we're actually stalked by government contractors and people have threatened to kill her, namely my former ASIO partner who was my fiance for five years. And um the government's really pitted against me. So um yeah, this is me and Crystal. And Crystal, what are you going over there for? Well, it's not finished talking. You've got to sit down. You've got to sit down. Sit down there, nice. Sit down nice. Sit down nice. Sit, sit, sit. And can you do high, high five? High five? High five? High five? High five? Do you want to smack her? High five. High five. Oh, she's so stubborn. <laughs> my name's um my 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 old name's Dr. Rich McLean. And my new name's Baron Dodger, because I actually suicided a few years ago and um the hospital covered it up and I've got a bit of a brain injury. I also suffer from schizophrenia and um, ADHD and um, a cognitive brain disorder from the, um, she's got food, at least he's got food, and um, from the um, from the suicide attempt. So, um, I mean, I'd love a new pair of glasses. I'd love an internet connection and a phone that works and so many things, but most of all, I want to feel safe. And um, I don't feel safe here because I'm followed, I'm under investigation and, um, I've asked everyone there is to ask. So if you're out there and you're in Sydney, fuck it. I'll give you my number. It's 0433 514 524. Please read Crystal and I's story at barrendodger.com.au. I'm a rejected whistleblower. I can't go to police and I can't get a lawyer. It's a very difficult place and I live in poverty, abject poverty, and I'm a doctor of philosophy. I'm not silly. And it's one of the reasons they've targeted me. And so um, I hope you can help me, Crystal. Crystal, would you like a dental stick? A dental stick? <laughs> Come here. So, um, yeah, thanks for listening. Thanks for seeing our little video. We're beautiful people. And Crystal's... <laughs> Sorry. The most beautiful person. And we'd like to feel safe and we'd, we'd like a home where we're not persecuted and followed and financially abused. If you can help us, go to barrendodger.com.au and have a look at this story. It's pretty wild. And um, we hope that you can help us get to a safe place. Please. Okay. Crystal, you want to smack her?